What's up, family? It's Sunny here, or Zen, or Tasso, or you know, whatever you want. Um, I'm gonna start doing daily prayers because I think I think we need it. And um <laughs> y'all see the homie. What's his name? Guy Fox. It's almost November 5th. But uh yeah, back to the 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 point at hand. I want to start doing daily prayers because at the end of the day, that's the only way that we're gonna change anything. Like in our in our own strength, we can only do so much. We need God. <laughs> That's, that's all we can rely on. And so I'm going to just take a verse, pray about it for about a minute, and then let y'all on the rest of your day. Easy. Today I'm reading from 2 Chronicles chapter 16, verse 9. And the prayer is for perfected hearts that are fully committed to him. It says, For the eyes of the Lord range throughout the earth to strengthen those whose hearts are fully committed to him. And so my prayer today, God, is that you begin to strengthen us, perfect us. Elsewhere in your word, you say that the harvest is plentiful, but the workers are few. So right now we volunteer as tribute. <laughs> we say, God, here I am. Please use me for your perfect plan, for your perfect will on earth, that your righteousness will begin to reign, oh God. I ask that you begin to increase yourself in us, that your spirit begin to infuse our lives, oh God that you begin to perfect our hearts, our minds, our, our bodies, that we are completely set apart and set aside for your good plans on earth. Help us, O oh God, to see what you have for us, to reject all evil, to only accept what is good. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your word. And thank you for your spirit. We give you all the glory. And it is in Jesus' name that I pray. Amen. Thank you for joining me today. We'll be back tomorrow. Um, until then, take it easy. Happy Monday. And uh, yeah, stay in love. <laughs> Cheers.